Good morning, everyone. Today, we're actually awake in the morning. I know that's crazy, but we're going to the parade here in a minute. And then we'll go to the car show. Anyway, we have the car show and then probably headed home after that point. So, fun stuff. We made it to Ronnie and Jordan's house and then found out that's not where we're supposed to be parking. So, we are switching Can spots. Go that way? I don't know how we'll get back in, but... We'll figure it out. Anyway, we got there, and then I realized Mom texted me after we had left, so it was a minute ago. And said we park here. Oof. And said we park at this pin, so... We're switching. So... We're trying to get there, but the road that we have to like cross is all blocked off because for a parade. So we'll get there. That was my dad's friend Gene with my grandpa's panel wagon. We're practicing. We're practicing. Yep. <laughs> Neymar just didn't want to be in the stroller as we walked to the car show. So I'm, I'm holding him while Ty holds the umbrella because Ty's the one who pulled Neymar out of the stroller. Yeah, Ty, so we get the clingy consequence. Because he wanted to. <laughs> because he felt sad that he was in there. But now he's just walking and saying, whoa. He was so sad. Are you going to go to the car show? Yeah? Uh, Ty's not doing his job. <laughs> I'm not the. We came to Fat Jacks and they're. You got the boxes, yes. Okay, let's put them in right now. Anyway, we got two things of cheese sticks. The cheese sticks here are the best things ever. We just got done at the pizza place and we are headed home. We were trying to decide whether or not we are going to stay for the rodeo tonight and leave later tonight. But then it was like, it's 2... It's 3.30. It's 3.30 right now and the rodeo's at 8. And it was like, well what are we going to do until then? My parents are going to go and do their thing. Brian and tomorrow are going to go do their thing. And I was like, I don't really have anything I want to do for five hours, yeah. So we just said, you know what, let's just, let's just go home. I was like, I need to get a video filmed um, and edited by Monday and it's Saturday right now. I'm pretty caught up on the vlog so it's okay, but I was also hoping to get the house clean before Sunday so we could just make filming our top priority tomorrow and then just seeing family and stuff. So it was just like, what are we gonna do? And then my mom was like, just come to the rodeo. Because they bought us tickets, but I thought the tickets were for yesterday because we went with them yesterday. We thought those were for yesterday. So. Maverick and the cat scales. Uh uh, what is that? I don't know. There's a cat scale. I'll just show you when we leave. Anyway, we're headed home now. We just barely got back. Well, not just barely. We kind of just hung out for a second, just relax, because. Well, it wasn't like it wasn't a bad car. Drive. It was like four four hours ish, which isn't bad, but so not fun to be in a car for four hours. And Danielle got this new fun thing. Yeah, I have had a dot dot for like one of these diamond dot things in the past, but I never finished it. <laughs> the other day I thought about them and was like, oh fun! I need a craft to do at home because I don't have one. Yeah, so now she's doing this hocus pocus one. So that yeah. should be fun. And I just cleaned all this litter box, which was so, so gross. But now I'm probably gonna head to the gym in just a second, because I haven't been for the past little bit, which I guess makes sense because we've been on vacation, I guess. I just wanna see if she does it again. 
I was sitting here doing this and she's trying to climb in my shirt. She's oh so needy. For a cat, she's so, so needy. Okay, so that's when I made it to the gym and I went to the Five Below when we went shopping that one day. I wanted to buy these because I think part of the reason, because I don't know if you guys have noticed, because I wear my AirPods a lot, and I know you guys all know that, but they are kind of gross. And I think part of it is because I wear it when I go to the gym, so it's like the sweat and all that crap that is just stuck to it. And so I'm gonna try to wear these, and I've been try I've tried them out on the way over here. And the only sucky part about these ones is that there's like no bass to them. But for like really good gym songs, in my opinion, have a lot of bass. And so I'm gonna have to switch up what I listen to or go back to my AirPods. But I'm gonna try these today and see how I like them. So I just barely got back from the gym and it was, it was good. It was good to be back. And my arm is shaky, that's not good. But it was good. We, I got talking to this random old dude cause I was, I don't know if you guys have seen it, but I've used like that blue band around my elbows. And so that's how it started talking. He's like, what the heck are you doing? Like what? And started asking questions about that. But then, so now I got a new gym friend. Ty is such a talker. I'm not. It's like the first random person I've talked no, to. No, that's like, time. he's such a talker. Like, we went to the beach one time. There was this random group of people, and Ty just walked over and became best friends with No, them. they talked to me. You held up a conversation. People talk to me all the time, and I'm like, yep. So? He talks to people all the time, and he's like, I'm so shy. But here's the thing, he's one of those shy people that will still talk to people. You know, he's not socially awkward. Just doesn't matter. But yeah, I had a good time at the gym. It was fun. It is 9.23 and I am going to eat some cheese sticks because we brought them just for this specific reason. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We were talking to him about it the other day and told Ty's brother Jake that we should play Minecraft with them. And Ty just barely called Jake and said, let's play Minecraft. And Jake said, I'm literally playing Minecraft right now. Yes, so now we're, what? So now we're gonna play Minecraft. <sighs> okay, so we've just been, been hanging out. We played Minecraft for a little bit. But now, because we don't want to sit, well, don't we just want to, I don't know. But we want to play one of our new games we got. We got, what game did we get? Bananagrams. I was struggling to like hold still. So I was like, let's go do something. Maybe we should go for a walk or something too. Actually, it's 12 o'clock and our neighborhood can be kind of sketchy at times, so probably not. Yeah, the banana grams is this one. I played it before and put it on the vlog. Yeah. If you guys don't know, we have to make words and whoever has the most words wins. Yeah. Or I don't know, we kind of just go and it's like, you can play it competitive or you can play it just for fun. I usually just play it for fun. We just see if we can make the most words with it and it's it's a fun game it, it's, it's scrabble is that the word that i'm trying to think game i'm trying to think of it's kind of like that okay so we're not done but we're almost done playing our first round so this is how it's looking i'm so removing the rules as i go she kind of forgot how to play just a little bit but i don't know how you forget how to play banana plants <laughs> way to go but yeah, you have to make all the words and then like let's say I didn't want the this H, right? You can put that back and then I have to take three I can't I'm using the camera see three random ones. Two three and now I have to make a word with these that somehow fits into this. But like they can't I'm like trying to show this but I'm like right here, but like they like can't touch. So like they can touch like right here, they can touch diagonally. But they all have to work left to right and up to down. But that's like the gist of the game and then we just try to see how has the most point and the biggest 
connection of stuff. It's a hard game, but I've played it enough with Savannah and her siblings that I can kind of know words now, so that helps me. Camille's putting her stuff away already, but we finished the first round. And, and it was fun. Again, we just play it for fun. We don't really ever play it. I don't really ever play it like competitive where you're like, oh, who got who got more? You know, it's just more like, oh, who, like, you know, for fun, who got more? But that was fun. I think. And I got maybe 13 at most. Yeah. I actually would have counted. Yeah, and it's kind of hard to count too just because there's so much like going on. But. I, I think that was one of my best rounds, though. It is almost 3 a.m. I'm freezing to death because this house is always freezing. It's the only way Ty survives. But I'm going to shower and go to bed. So I love you guys. Always remember that you are worth it.